I'm so busy. Some nights I think I can get away with just a few hours of sleep. Is that true? When I was in medical school, I often worked 36 hours in a row and then drove home and collapsed. When I think of this now, I cringe. Thankfully, with the new research on sleep, doctors don't work those kind of shifts anymore. I'm a big fan of sleep now. It's so important, I devoted an entire chapter to it in my book, Super Healing, because it is a necessary part of healing from an injury or illness, and it is also vital for maintaining good health. 24 hours without sleep or a week of sleeping only four or five hours a night causes people to perform similarly to how they'd perform if they had a blood alcohol level of 0.1%. Today, you can literally burn the midnight oil all night long, communicating with people on the other side of the world who are appropriately awake while you should be sleeping. But it's not good for you. Instead, you want to aim to get seven to eight hours of sleep every night. Here are some tips. Avoid alcohol and caffeine late in the day. Go to bed and get up at a regular time. It helps to have a schedule. Read a book rather than watch TV just before bed. If you don't sleep well due to pain, anxiety, or some other medical problem, talk to your doctor. And if you don't sleep well one night, rather than worrying about it, try to repay your sleep debt the next night and turn in a little bit early. From Harvard, I wish you good health.